Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And we have pre-season group stage action coming right up for you. It's Portsmouth, and they take on Leganes. Well, thanks, Derek. This is their first pre-season game. Time for players to get their match fitness, coaches to develop tactics, new signings to be integrated, and maybe youngsters to be given a chance. And this is the starting 11 for Portsmouth. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. The starting 11 then for Leganes. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And the match begins. He continues his run. Munoz. Aviles. Gaku Shibasaki. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner. But oh, this... Derek, there's a chance here. And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Funda Barena. Gaku Shibasaki. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Who can he pick out? Beyond the last defender, offside. Nice looking pass. Running with the ball confidently. Wonderful chance. Oh, a tremendous block. They couldn't maintain possession.
Gaku Shibasaki. Munoz. Well, they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. And an astute piece of defending. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. In position. Rafferty. That's well blocked. And the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. Let's see about the delivery. Can they spot it home? Just cleared away in the nick of time. Aviles. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Dangerous looking attack. Time to play is over. And making the move to the inside. Must be! And quite simply, a wonderful chance was squandered. Munoz. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. But then the one that goes astray. Now can they counter clinically? Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. It has to be! No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Now, options are plenty. But they dealt with the threat first. It's with Pereira. Hernandez. And giving it away. opportunity but a comfortable piece of defending extremely sloppy in possession board showing one additional minute Pereira and a chance for him on the flank and teammates to play it to and with that the first half comes to an end here in Turin So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. It's with Pereira. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Splendid tackle, and a throw-in coming up. Nyom. 
continues his run. A really good block. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Well, we've been wondering for a while now, would it happen for Manchester United? Now it has happened on the transfer front, Stuart. Yeah, I like the look of it. I think it's a good move for both him and the club. Let's hope he makes an impact fairly quickly. He scored once already and close to making it a double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. Here it is now, a substitution. And over it comes, and the danger still on. Now well, play stopped, it is a free kick. Da Barena. Gaku Shibasaki. Munoz. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? And they'll be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Now, can they make something happen? Well, decent save there. And a substitution in the offing. Over it comes. A decisive clearance it was. Determined defending. Break. Going well. And it might be. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Could be a chance to break here. And unable to keep the ball. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Good pressure high up the pitch. Can he take advantage? Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Rabba. Top-class defending. Intelligent threaded pass here. Firing it towards goal. Body in the way. And just losing control of the ball, and it will be a throw-in. Substitution then, let's see how it affects the match. Connor Ogilvy. Disappointing pass. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Could play it in. And the referee says penalty. So a personnel change then. Chance to even things up here. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot.
here it is again. Great composure to send the keeper the wrong way before striking it into the opposite side. That's an excellent penalty. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Marlon back. Well, they still have designs on the win. Can they forge ahead? No! And all because of the goalkeeper. Margins, margins. Well, he has done well there, but he should have won the game. They probably won't get another chance now. Trying to deliver it accurately. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance, and the fans are lapping this up. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Munoz. And out of play. The pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Bunda Barena. Munoz. And now Danny Jimenez. And the electronic board has been held aloft. Three additional minutes here. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? This could square the game. But no, thanks to the goalkeeper. Opportunity not taken. Well, you're absolutely right, Derek. The keeper's done really well there. But really, that should have been the equaliser. And there's not long left now. Late corner could represent the last chance to equalize. And there goes the final whistle, and the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Yes, Derek, sometimes it takes a while to eventually get the better of the opposition, and that was the case here. They kept going and they eventually got their reward.
Hello to you from Milan, a city synonymous with high fashion. The stadium might not be fashionable anymore, but it remains iconic, the San Siro. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we have more live action from the pre-season second group stage. It's Bordeaux versus Portsmouth. Well, Derek, both teams will want to get to the knockout stage. So we'll be looking for three points here today. And it may be pre-season, but there's still silverware on offer. And that will give them confidence going forward into the new campaign. is how Bordeaux will line up. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. dissect the Portsmouth starting 11. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. And the contest begins. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man, I think, Stuart. What are you expecting to see from him? Well, Derek, he's certainly going to be the key player today. Last time out, he scored those two goals, but it's his general play that was outstanding. Getting on the ball, making things happen, and he got his reward with the brace. And I'm expecting to see exactly the same again today. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. A over promise on the flank. Danilo Ignatenko. Just the challenge that was required. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. This is looking threatening. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So, underway again here. One nil the score. Ellis moving the ball effectively a wonderful intervention well the counter chance looks very real do they have the guile to open up the defence real chance and the keeper more than equal to it
And over comes the corner. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. The corner kicks keep on coming. And he clears the danger. Uda. Simba. Ignatenko. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. And back with Blake, getting the better of his opponents. Well, defending always has to be a team effort. Good piece of covering. Under a fair bit of pressure. Danilo Ignatenko and out of play the pass nearly worked out but not quite Lane a chance to whip it in very quick thinking there doing all he can to grab his second of the game. Well, he's been a real live wire today, a constant threat to this back line. And he's fired over the corner, and the problem not completely solved. Well, nothing untoward happened. Danilo Ignatenko. Remy Uda, Simba. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Sean Raggett. Blake. Now, let's see what they can do here. Is it going to be? And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And it will be goalkeeper's ball. Well, foul play, says the referee. Or would it happen or would it not? It has now happened officially. Riyad Mahrez has completed his move to Spurs. Well, this is probably his last big move, so I just hope it works for everybody concerned. If he plays well, he'll have a massive impact on them. Lowry. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. They need to stop him. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And intercepts again. And he might be through here. Well, it looked as though it had a chance of going in. Well, he should make the keeper work there, but you sense a goal is coming. Well, that's going to be all for the first half here at the San Siro. So, back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Ignatenko.
Huda. Interception to snuff out the danger. And options in the centre. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Barbe. Vital Simba. Promising looking ball. Surely the equaliser. the goalkeeper's life simple that should be hit in the back of the net that was a big big chance Marlon Pack and back with Blake good technique display could be a smart stop here they will now make use of the substitutes bench Trying to pick out a teammate and clearing it away. Well, another corner following on from the last one. And the header off target, but resolute defence. So a half an hour remaining. And that was a very fine read. Oh, he looks threatening. Oh, could be. And a goal. They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Ellis. Uda. Danilo Ignatenko. A fine use of the ball. Ignatenko. There it is! A goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? He's protecting it well. But just like that, possession changes hands. Cruz. Can they create something from here? Opportunity to deliver the cross. He must finish! And the keeper more than equal to it. And the substitution will occur now. Who can he pick out? Well, he failed to get it away properly. Still looking to get the shot off. And a good take under duress there. Fifteen minutes left for play. Tom Lowry. Have we got to stop him?
Now, who can he play it to? Well, he really read that brilliantly. Parrot. As the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. Well, the action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Ellis. Beautiful pass. And that is offside. Gutierrez. Unable to keep the ball that time. Ellis. Troy Parrott. And can they exploit the space out wide? And delivered into the box. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Safe pair of hands, did his job. And there it is, the full-time whistle here, and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. This is looking threatening.